Today on the Daily Deposit we will discuss 10-year-olds among hundreds of children found working at McDonald's restaurants. Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button like it owes you money and don't forget to smack the like button with a virtual high five. A recent investigation by the U.S. Labor Department has revealed that over 300 children, including two 10-year-olds, were found to be working in violation of federal labor laws at various McDonald's locations across Kentucky, Indiana, Maryland, and Ohio. Two 10-year-olds were discovered working unpaid and until as late as 2 a.m. at one McDonald's restaurant in Louisville operated by Bauer Food LLC. The children were found to be preparing and distributing food orders, cleaning the store, working at the drive through window, and operating a register. One of them was even operating a deep fryer, which is prohibited by federal law for workers under the age of 16. Bauer Food LLC has denied employing the two children, stating that they were the children of a night manager who were visiting their parent at work and were not approved by the franchisee organization management to be in that part of the restaurant. However, the franchisee has since taken steps to ensure that policies regarding children visiting a parent or guardian at work are clear to all employees. Tiffany Boyd, Senior Vice President and Chief People Officer at McDonald's USA, has stated that the reports are unacceptable and deeply troubling. She emphasized the significant responsibility McDonald's carries to ensure a positive and safe experience for everyone under the arches, adding that the company is committed to ensuring its franchisees have the resources they need to foster safe workplaces for all employees and maintain compliance with all labor laws. The investigation has brought to light the importance of enforcing federal labor laws, especially in industries where minors may be employed. It also highlights the responsibility of companies to ensure their franchisees are following regulations and providing a safe work environment for their employees, including children. The McDonald's franchisees involved in this case should be held accountable for their actions and take appropriate measures to prevent such violations from occurring in the future. Cha-ching, there you have it your deposit has cleared. If you like these stories, please like and subscribe, and don't forget to click the bell icon to be the first to receive all our deposits as they become available.